Virgos, how are you guys doing? Welcome to my channel. I hope you guys are very, very well. I hope all is great. Let's see what's going on with your energy at this time, guys. If you guys are interested in a personal reading, okay, my information is below. If I've missed your emails, I'm very sorry, okay, but all my readings are soul to soul readings, okay, pertaining to your situation, of course. And of course, follow me on Instagram and a like if this resonates with you guys. All right, so let's see what's going on, Virgo, Virgo, Sun, Moon, Venus signs. What's going on with my beautiful Virgos at this time? Virgos for their highest good. Waiting. I'm waiting. So you guys definitely have uh, someone at this time definitely waiting for you, waiting for you to communicate, waiting for you to reach out here. Um, cancer energy, of course. Um, we have a fire sign as well. Could be dealing with a Sagittarius, Leo, or an Aries, okay? Um, I do see some sort of distance, okay? I do see some sort of traveling, some sort of separation, some sort of barrier here. I feel like someone here needs to find the courage to either reach out or communicate something here. I do feel like, again, like I said, someone here is waiting. It's like I'm waiting for some sort of communication. I'm waiting for some sort of um, dialogue between us here, okay? Also, you have someone that may be watching you, hoping that you would reach out, hoping that the these emotions are still potent, these emotions are still present. So I'm wondering if you're still interested in me. I'm wondering if uh, we could speak or we could talk here, okay? I do get a lot of emotions here, okay, guys? I, you could have been dealing with somebody that possibly kept you waiting for a while, um, but I feel like it's one of those things where somebody is pulling back or holding back at this time, right? I'm holding back, all right? Let's see what is the obstacle at this time. What is the obstacle energy at this time? Thank you. The moon here. So we have secrets, all right? There could have been some secrets here, something that someone here possibly was not revealing, something that was hidden, okay? Something that you guys found out, okay? But I do feel like there is a lot of emotions that are not being spoken about. Like, I feel this way about this situation or um, I'm not really expressing how I truly feel. There was something that, again, like I said, that was revealed and I feel like someone here is trying to figure out how you may be feeling about this situation if you're still interested because I'm still interested in you right but again a lot of emotions not being spoken about okay so let's dig deeper and let's see what is going on this could be somebody that again like i said at a distance i do get an energy of distance this could be physical distance um emotional distance as well could be somebody you're living with but again like i said it's like a lot of unspoken truth here okay someone here needs to come clean or open up about a situation all right so let's and dig deeper virgos let's see what else we could find with this energy virgos please virgos virgo sun moon venus signs thank you all right cold shoulder so again you may not be speaking to this person for a lot of you guys it's like i'm definitely turning my back on this situation or this could have been somebody here that may be turning their back on you one of the things i'm feeling here is someone here is uh, somewhat turning their back, but at the same time, still waiting for you to reach out, right? Where I'm not talking to you, but I'm still focused on you, right? I'm still thinking about you. I still feel you. I still feel your energy. Okay. What is this about? What else? Okay. So we have regrets here. So somebody here, I feel like they know that they did something wrong. I feel like they know they said something wrong. It was again, like I said, the moon here, there was something that someone here, um, possibly, um, you know, wasn't being upfront about, wasn't being honest about here. And I feel like this person's possibly waiting to see what you're going to do. Okay. But I do feel like someone here is having a lot of regrets. It's like the more we don't speak, the more we don't communicate, the more I get to kind of like think about my actions, so to speak. I'm thinking about my behavior. I'm thinking about how I possibly just, um, stepped over my boundaries in terms of trust. Okay. Let's see what we could expect into this future with this connection virgos please it's not over so someone here doesn't feel like this is over we have a lot of history we have a lot of history we have a lot here okay and i feel like someone here it's like i've been through so much in the past right someone here it's like i've been through so much in the past but this connection is different 
all right i feel like this connection is different i feel like someone here truly does not want to release this connection okay could be dealing with somebody that's definitely has been hurt they possibly haven't spoken about it much i don't really talk about my emotions i don't really express them too much but i know when i'm wrong here okay whether this person's admitting admitting this or not here okay it's like you are a dream come true you're like the person that i've always dreamt about the person that i've always really wanted okay but again like i said this person could have been a non-committal um person or they were possibly afraid of possibly opening up honestly about what was going on here but i do feel like someone here it's like they keep coming back i get this energy of uh push and pull it's like a, a push and pull energy here for you guys okay let me get a vibe here okay the first one was the moon so definitely a lot of secrets this person could be in this place as well uh feeling like they do not know how to fix this situation or they don't know what to say at this time it's like yeah i'm not speaking to you but i truly don't even know what to say like what's my purpose of my silence right now right okay because i feel like there is a conversation that is going to take place here and i feel like someone here is a bit in limbo of what to honestly say because of all this guilt and regret it's like you know you got caught possibly okay whatever that moon was representing for you guys what is the energy for this connection song so a lot of you guys this is like a cycle that you guys possibly have been dealing with here um, a cycle within this connection that a lot of you guys are constantly feeling like you're going through it's like I've spoken to this person numerous of times but this person's not really hearing me I don't feel like they're they're really truly listening to me right I'm trying to get this person to communicate with me on a deeper level but they're not trying to meet me halfway here okay so someone here it's like I feel like I'm not being heard is what I'm hearing right I feel like you're not hearing me right I feel like a broken record in a sense okay someone here could be again like I said just closed off we're going to see what's going on with this cold sh uh, shoulder energy okay see what they have to say about that I have a cold shoulder but I still love you right there's there's a lot of things that I need to say and I see this person replaying this in their head whatever conversation you had with this person whatever um, dialogue you had with this person they're replaying it in their head because there's a lot of love here I will say that here this person knows that you have a lot of love for them this person knows that they have a lot of love for you here all right but I feel like again it's like I keep being, you know, bringing this cold energy towards this union. I keep on bringing this um, doubtful energy towards this union here, okay? Because it's interesting how this person uh, is one minute they're cold and the next minute they're trying to figure out how you feel, okay? Again, so some of you guys, I feel like this person is wondering, curious, is this over? Could be dealing with a Scorpio here. Is this over, right? Is this something that I'm able to continue? Is Virgo going to take me back? Is Virgo going to forgive me, right? Or uh, vice versa. But I do feel like someone feels like there needs to be a drastic change in this relationship in terms of communication, in terms of um, how we um, turn our backs on each other. I feel like also another thing that um, someone may be stressing about is the way that this person neglects this connection, right? It's like, the more i think about it the more i feel how lonely and alone i am in this true connection okay and i feel like someone here is getting tired of that energy of constantly feeling left out okay or you could be dealing with someone that is always feeling like you know they're being left out to some extent but again i feel like someone here feels very neglected and unheard like you're not listening to me this could have been someone again in the past that rejected your offers and i feel like now you're in this energy of i'm turning my back but i still love them right i'm turning my back on this situation a lot of love here gemini energy um a lot of love here you know and i feel like this is where the regret comes in because there's so much love here there's so much passion there's such a deep connection that this person can't deny that right you can't deny this connection you could only i mean you could try right but it's it's not something energetically that this person could truly do okay because i feel like this person again it's like they're thinking about their actions right they're thinking about the way that they weren't patient with you how they weren't patient with this connection okay i do feel like someone is feeling a bit frustrated here with the seven of pentacles it's like i'm frustrated with trying to you know um get this person to understand where i'm coming from someone here has invested a lot of energy into this connection invested a lot of energy in trying to uh, even forgive 
this person, honestly. I feel like there's been a lot of forgiveness, but someone just kind of um, felt like whatever the secret was, it felt like, you know, this person betrayed me in a sense here. Okay. How is Virgo's person feeling at this time? Yeah, I hear, I still love you, right? I know you love me and I love you. I love you. But I feel like someone here is withdrawing. Someone here went completely silent, okay? Someone's going silent. Someone's asking for space. But I feel like at the same time, there's this energy of I'm still watching. I'm still curious about where we stand. Patience. So they're asking for patience here. Could be dealing with a Sag. Um, but again, during this time of patience and healing, someone here is really, truly feeling this energy of I'm, I'm sort of I'm sort of fed up. OK, I'm sort of fed up of trying to um, constantly communicate with this person. We have the wands here. This is ineffective communication. Right. I try to communicate with this person. I've been patient with this person through their healing, through their struggles, through whatever it may be, um, financial difficulties, whatever it is. But this person's not patient with the way that they speak to me, with the way that they um, nurture this connection. Right. If they do that at all. Again, guys, I see a lot of communication wanting to come in. OK, so someone here, I feel like they're losing patience and they're wanting to communicate with you again. Why? That's why we have the not over energy. It's like I want to communicate with you here. <laughs> I want to communicate with you. How is Virgo feeling about this person? How is Virgo feeling about this person, please? I feel like someone has learned so much about themselves in this connection. Someone here is learning patience, okay? How to be patient with themselves, with love. How's Virgo feeling? Yeah, you guys are feeling a bit fed up, a bit bored, a bit, um, you know, stubborn as well. I feel like someone here is making a decision and they're really trying to stand by this decision. Like, you know, I don't want to really talk to this person right now. I'm tired of trying to say the same thing to this person. Although there's a lot of passion, there's a lot of, um, there's a strong connection, I should say. But I'm so tired of, of hearing the same thing from this person, right? Which is, I'm not listening. Okay. And I feel like that's one of the main things that you've been dealing with, dealing with someone that's not really listening to, uh, the love that you're trying to, um, get them to understand. Give me, what could my Virgos expect moving forward with this connection, please? What could we expect here? Yeah. Someone here, I honestly, I feel like someone here is really at the end of their ropes here. But again, I feel like this is something where you guys will have some sort of communication. I feel like this person will learn how to communicate, okay? But I feel like this person's going back and forth. It could be between two people or going back and forth in terms of what they're going to say because we have the wands here. So someone here wants to communicate, but I feel like they have this energy of, again, I do not know what to say right? I do not know how to fix this, but I definitely do not feel like this is over. And the way that this person's coming in Virgo, I feel like they're coming in very quickly. All right. But it's really up to you whether you're going to really let this person in. And I feel like that's one of the obstacles as well, where this person feels like, is Virgo going to let me in? Right. Is Virgo going to open up to me again? Right. Did I blow it this time or what? Okay. What else could we expect here? Family. Yeah. So this is, again, you know, this is somebody that wants to have a serious conversation. Okay. I want the 10 of pentacles with you. Okay. Could be dealing with another Virgo Taurus or Capricorn here. Energy, a lot of stability. Someone wants to bring in that stability within this relationship. Okay. And I feel like as you guys wait, or as you guys, um, choose to pull back, there will be a strong energy of you focusing on yourself and focusing on your career and also focusing on your loyalty towards, um, you know, your success at this time. Okay. Cause I feel like you guys are really protecting yourself at this time and just trying to really be happy or I'm really trying to be happy. I'm trying to stay away from anything that may seem to be a bit confusing to me emotionally. Okay. So let's get some more messages and see what else is going on. Cause I definitely feel like there's this silent energy in the room of again here with the moon and the wands here guys it's like is virgo going to talk to me right is virgo going to say something to me if so when and what are they going to say okay because i feel like someone here is waiting but they're just like when 
Like, when, when are you going to talk to me again? Okay? When are you going to say something to me? All right? When are you going to say something? All right. So let's get some messages, guys, and see what else we have here. What are the messages for my beautiful Virgos? Thank you. True love. Okay? And we also have easy does it, Virgos. Okay, there is no need to hurry or force things to happen. Everything is occurring in perfect timing. Everything is occurring in perfect timing, Virgo. Okay, so what else do we have here? We have true love. Okay, the romantic stirrings in your heart has propelled the universe to deliver great love to you. Okay, so a lot of you guys may be in this place where it's like I'm only accepting, you know, real offers here. Okay, but again, I feel like there's an apology that needs to come in. All right, someone here, another thing that I was getting here is someone here is trying to kind of like let time pass in order to make sure someone's not upset. Like I'm going to just wait a while until someone gets over something because someone feels neglected here and I feel like someone again wanting to come in, but there's a time, there's like a time gap that they're putting in here because I feel like someone may be uh, uh, still upset about whatever was exposed here. Okay. I love you guys. Have an amazing day.